I'm Will, and welcome to the Falcon Report. The stories for the week are interview with Coach Payne and interview with Ollie the Puppet, interview with Miss Petrie, and kindergarten letter of the week. Now to the show. Thanks, Will. Hi, I'm Stan, and I'm here with Coach Payne to interview him on Playwork. So what's your top favorite three, three Playworks games and why? Me, personally, I really like Watch Your Back Tag. It's also called Everybody's It Tag, because everyone's it. And uh, it's fun to just play that, and everyone can join in. It's really easy to just jump on in the game. I really like Splat. It's very challenging. Um, you can make it really hard or really simple, depending on um, your skill level. And then I really love Bridge Ball. Um, that's a really fun game to just start out. It's super easy to make. Why do you like, what do you like about coach, coaching P? Oh man, I love hanging out with you kids. Um, you say the funniest things, and I love seeing you play some new games that you've never played before. And I just love being active with you all. Thank you for your time. Now to Dima f for Kindergarten Letter of the Week. Hi, I'm Dima, and I'm here with Lucy and May Lee for Kindergarten Letter of the Week. So what's the letter of the week? I. I. Awesome. What does I say? Eh. Thanks. What words do, what words have I in the middle of them? Hey. Thanks guys, you did amazing. Bye. Hi, I'm Stein and I'm here with Miss Petrie to interview her on how to stack library books. So what is the first step? Okay, hi. The first step that I do when I'm shelving my books is First of all, we look at the call number. Everyone should know what that is. And I first look to see if it's in fiction or nonfiction or early reader. So this book is in fiction. So I come to the fiction section and then I look for the author's last name right here on the spine. This one says R-O-W for Rowling. So then we're gonna go into the fiction section using our, our little labels and look for the, the letter to the last name, which is R. And then we're gonna go, it's all in alphabetical order. So we just look for R-O-W. So we come down here and find R-O-W. And these are all sorted by type. So it's gonna go right here. And I put the book in. And then one thing I wanna make sure I always do is keep the shelves looking nice. So I just kind of push them up and straighten them so they look nice. That's how I shelf books. Thank, thank you so much for your time. Sure. This guy. So what's your name? Hi, Dima. My name's Ollie. I'm the Christmas Spirit Puppet. Can you tell us a little bit about this recent sing-along? Sure! The sing-along is a tradition we've had at Sprucewood for many, many years. It is for all of our students to come to the gym to sing their favorite traditional non-religious Christmas song. But this year, we're also going to sing songs from around the world. Thank you. We hope to see you there. It'll be great. And remember, everybody, practice your singing. The announcements for the week are Project Teddy Bear, 5th grade state fair on the t 19th, Along with that, the Choir and Orchestra will be performing at 2 p.m. On the 21st, a sing-along will be held. Only for students, though, the day after winter recess will start. Hallelujah! Thanks for watching. Wait, what am I supposed to say?